this is another meeting with the Secretary General. Planteando la profundización de la we were speaking about strengthening cooperation between the different agencies of the United Nations in Venezuela. You know that the economy in Venezuela has been very disrupted, and it's necessary there to have multilateralism in this case to overcome any impact of unilateralism and thus cooperate eagerly, get cooperation, and even the state could also invest in projects that have been tailored by the United Nations, by its different agencies for food, for health, for the needs of the people. The Secretary General has always been open and willing to do so and he has gathered information about the political reality of Venezuela. He is happy to see Venezuela in peace. This has been an excellent meeting. You have spoken about this project of solving this with the United States in order to pressure the Secretary General to call elections in Venezuela and bring in humanitarian aid. We did not speak about these type of things. We were speaking about the structural topics and matters that are important for Venezuela, not about propaganda of the United States and their propaganda actions. We spoke about serious things. Thank you. Can you tell us what you spoke about with the General Secretary? This is the second meeting with the Secretary General this year, and uh, we were talking about um, deepening, strengthening the cooperation of the agencies of the United Nations, the system of the United Nations in Venezuela, no? with more cooperation. And you know that our economy has been damaged by um, foreign um, interventions, and of course we have always had the confidence and we trust in multilateralism, we trust in the system of the United Nations in order to um, make things, positive things happen in Venezuela. So that is essentially what we spoke about. We gave him some information about the, um, uh, the, the real uh, uh, picture of Venezuela at the moment, and it was a very good meeting as it has always been with, with the Secretary General Guterres.